we're here at the 2017 Flying Eagle Open Disc Golf Tournament. Uh, we're in our third year, and this year we've actually added to our list of courses. Uh, we play at Hole in the Sky Disc Golf Course. We also get to put 18 baskets out on the back nine of Gypsum Creek Golf Course here. And then brand new this year, uh, the Scott family of Gypsum have put in a private course. And we're really psyched to have all three courses running at the same time this year. Um, unique about this tournament is we get to play on a golf course, which is really kind of really rare in our sport. Usually we end up playing through the trees and through the forest. Sometimes we get some park courses, but when we get our chance to play on a golf course, we just feel honored. So we're, we're really happy to um, work with the people of Gypsum and the Gypsum Golf Course. Little two Miller. Great. Check. Little two. Four. Nice putt. Sa back. Saved a four. And I took a three on number two. Really thankful letting us get us on this ball golf course is pretty spectacular. So it's been amazing all the shots they've come up with, the design of the course laying out around. It follows the car path right along. It's pretty awesome. But yeah, it's just a beautiful view out here. So We had 216 people sign up for this tournament this year. That was the registration cap. The Flying Eagle Open has been, and as far as I know, will continue to be uh, an amateur and professional tournament. Uh, about a third of our field are in the professional ranks and the rest of the field is amateurs which break down into a number of different divisions based on skill level for masters, grandmasters, even senior grandmasters. I think you need to have a little bit of everything to win so skill wise you gotta be a full package to take the win so I, I like it, it's great. It's got a reputation as a, a must-do event for a lot of people, uh, not just locals, but also statewide, and we even get some people coming from nationwide as well. So uh, really great participation, one of the biggest events in the state, as far as what I hear, something that people want to come back to every year.